I am Erica Rose Arbenko and I'm going to discuss our national hero, Marcelo H. Del Pilar. Marcelo Hilario Del Pilar, Igat Maitan, commonly known as Marcelo H. Del Pilar and also known by his pen name Flaridel, was a Philippine revolutionary propagandist, satirist, writer, lawyer, journalist, and Freemason. He was born on August 30, 1850 in Bulacan and died on July 4, 1896 in Barcelona, Spain. Del Pilar, along with Jose Rizal and Luciano Lopez Jaina, became known as the leaders of the reform movement in Spain. He tried to marshal the nationalist sentiment of the enlightened Filipino illustrados or bourgeoisie against Spanish imperialism. He preached the gospel of work, self-respect, and human dignity. His mastery of the Tagalog enabled him to arouse the consciousness of the masses to the need for unity and sustained resistance against the Spanish tyrants. For his 150 essays and 66 editorials, mostly published in La Solidaridad and various anti-fire pamphlets, the Pilar is widely regarded as the father of Philippine journalism. Del Pilar was initiated into Freemasonry in 1889. He served as venerable master of the famous Solidaridad Lodge of Madrid. He was directly responsible for the establishment of the first national organization of Filipino Masons, the Gran Consejo Regional de Filipinas in 1893. With this, he earned the recognition as the father of Philippine Masonry. Some of historians and scholars believe that El Pilar was the true mastermind of the Katipuna. According to Leon Maria Guerrero, Del Pilar's letters were regarded by Bonifacio as important documents of the Philippine Revolution and guides for Katipunan's activities. Samahang Plaridet, an organization of veteran journalists and communicators, was founded in October 2003 to honor Del Pilar's ideals. On November 30, 1997, the Technical Committee of the National Heroes Committee Created through Executive Order No. 5 by former President Fidel Ramos, recommended with Del Pilar along with the eight Filipino historical figures to be national.